How you guys doing? Hey, this is Mario Burr here and glad you're taking the time out to watch this video on the content creation strategy. So in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you a couple things, okay? Content that your audience will be interested in and ultimately content that's going to get them to know you, get them to like you and trust you to the point where they would love to make a buying decision from you because they trust you. So that's what this content is all about. So let's go ahead and dive right into this, okay? So when creating your content, I want you to keep in mind these three things, these three things, okay? What type of products or services do you have to offer, all right? And next, you know, you want to make sure that you are being empowering, educating, ultimately, and sometimes entertain you know what i'm saying so also ask yourself what are some other things that you like to talk about around in this niche because when it comes to um creating your content you want to make sure that you 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 create it in the scope of your products your business and in and, and your services whatever it is okay and also when it comes to sharing your content on social media Understand that social media is not the place to be making sales. People come onto social media for uh, a few other things, and it is not to buy things. It is to connect, to entertain, and, and whatever other reasons um, there are. You know, but it, people do not say, "Hey, you know what? I think I'm gonna go on to um, Facebook and or YouTube to buy something." No, they don't do that. OK, so your content is there to um, pique their interest to the point where they will want uh, more information about what it is that you have to offer where you can share, um, share it with them, you know, whether it be on Messenger or on the phone, not here to sell on social media. OK, this is a bridge. That's what your content do. OK, so let's tap into some places, a place that you could get started like ASAP. Um, after this video to uh, start creating your content strategy. Okay, so what are some other places that you could take a look at? You know, we're being in um, this niche that we're in, this profession of, you know, network marketing or entrepreneurship or, you know, your a home business professional, we're all into personal development. So let's name a couple, a few big people in that area like Les Brown, Tony Robbins, Brian Tracy, Jim Rohn, just to name a few of the big one, the big wigs out there in that um, area. Say you're watching one of the videos or you, you've been on listening to one of the audios. Check this out, man. Take a, um, take what you learned, one or two things, one or two tips, share it in some content. And then ultimately transition that into your, you know, what it is that you have to offer. Because like I said, we're all into the, you know, we're all into entrepreneurship, the um, the home business, you know, space. All of us are into personal, personal development. Okay. So make sure you could do that. All right. What are some other places? How about some good books, some audios? How about some live training, some big events that you were at? You know, webinars, places that you took notes from. Look at some great things that you 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 know that your audience would be you know interested in. Because here's the thing: with your content, you want to make sure that your audience knows that you aren't coming off you are you aren't coming off trying to sell them, but you are more interested in being a problem solver to solve to give them a solution to what they are um struggling with okay and then you may be asking hey i'm a network marketer i'm trying to sell my products or services or you know recruit more people why would i want to try to recruit other network marketers or, or whatnot they already have a business you know what i'm saying you know yeah they do but here's the thing when you solve their problem, say you're talking to them, they liked your content that you put out, okay? But ultimately, 97% of marketers out there, people that, are, that that's, you know, in this um, profession, they're struggling. They're struggling. You know, they may have made a list. They may did all those traditional things that, you know, that upline told them to do. 
you know, make a list of family and friends and they may have burned through that list and they may be burnt out. They want to know how to um, say you're talking to them and you want the, 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 um, the maybe the, the, the conversation, you know, switch over and they share with you, hey, man, I'm struggling, you know, to generate leads. What are you doing to be able to generate leads, you know, to have targeted prospects that's already interested in what it is that I have to offer? OK, what are you doing to be able to attract them or what are you doing to, to have, you know, hot people to talk to that's already interested in what it is that you have to offer? And you can share with them, you know, it, like if you have some type of system, or if you have some type of product, if you're an affiliate of some type of um, educational platform that can help them, you can share that with them. All right. And I'll show you more about how this is actually done at the end of this video, okay? Just transition is really sweet, all right? So what about your own products or services? Sharing those on um, social media. That This right here is really hot. We call this, I'm gonna share this one um, strategy in particular. And guys, I'm only sharing with you only one or two, you know, two different tips that I took away from a, um, a, a, a training, a big training on, a unli it's called unlimited, you know, um, content creation strategy. Unlimited, unlimited. All right. So, but before we get into that, I'm going to share with you, you know, what this, uh, this strategy is called the curiosity post. This is awesome. I created one um, through a video with the company uh, that I'm in. I'm not going to get into names or anything like that. But what? let me just uh, share with you real quick. Before my wife and I bought our home, the mortgage company was trying to mess us over and with this high interest rate and so forth. So what I did is I contacted the service. Needless to say, they contacted them by a letter. Needless to say, the mortgage company contacted us back, you know. But in the meantime, when all that transpired, you know, that service that I had told you that I put on them, they recommended that we go with someone else because those people, what they ended up doing, they end up losing everything for them trying to be um, shady, basically. You know, so we went with someone else. Everything got done way faster while this other uh, mortgage company was messing around because of the service that I provided. And I shared this in a video on Facebook and you should have seen, I didn't share the name. I didn't share um, anything like that. All I did was share my testimonial in a video. And, and in order for them to um, watch the video, they had to put in their name and email address. I had a really great title to attract you know, um, those that were in real estate, I said, watch this or something like that before you think about buying your home. And I got people, you know, opting in and, you know, it was just awesome. Now, another one, another way you can do this is through a picture. I, I'm telling you, Lisa Torres is amazing at Curiosity Post. Man, you should see her engagement. But needless to say, how you do this, say you're in um, the health and wellness niche, man. And all you got to do, don't share the name of the product. Don't share the company that you are in. Share some key ingredients that you believe your audience will um, be interested in. And then hype it up, say, mm, yeah, and share a couple um, a short, you know, um, benefits of what it's doing for you, you know, and watch those comments. Hmm, what is this, you know, drink that you talking about here? You know, whatever it is, you know, it's a may it work. OK, so, man, that's called a curiosity post. That's is crazy, crazy content, crazy content. So, guys, ultimately, I hope this helped you out. I'll only share it with you like two tips here in this uh, this video, this piece of content on the content, uh, um, content creation strategy to help you in your MLM, your network marketing business or whatever um, business that you are in. Now, if you like this. I only share with you two out of a huge training, you know, the unlimited 
unlimited content um, creation strategy. Unlimited. I only shared with you two tips out of that. Now, if you want to get access to that whole, you know, training, click the link down below. Absolutely free. See how this is all done. See how I transitioned and learn from that as an example, how you imp can implement it into your own, you know, um, you know, your products, your business and services. But check it out, man. See how it's done. Click that link down below. Get access to the entire thing. This is Mario Bird. I'll see you guys on the inside. Make it a great day.